Hello everyone, welcome back to Isaac's Nature Channel Entomology. And here I have an absolutely giant caterpillar here. It's some kind of sphinx moth, as you can see, it's a little horn there. And my theory is that it is a uh, sphinx cherisis, or the great ash sphinx. You can see how large it is compared to my hand there. It's almost the size of my thumb. You can see just how giant it is. I'm sorry for the barking, that dog is just driving our family insane. Anyway, so, yeah. And it's pretty large, so I think it's probably 5th instar. It's kind of moving in a weird way. Just show you. It looks like it's shedding or something, it's really soft. So my theory is that, um, there is, that it's pupating, or at least shedding its skin. And I don't know the food plant yet, but I'm going to look up on the internet what it is and on the face here you can kind of see it's got some little white dots there those look like some kind of parasite so yeah I'm not so sure what that is but I'm just gonna put it in my hand real quick here you can see what it looks like see the face down there See, it's moving very strangely. It's almost pulsating. Anyway, that's how large it is in my hand. It's pretty big. My dad saw it from across the street. Some guy was taking a picture of it. But yeah, I'll put it in the cage and hopefully it's going to pupate. And I might get a great ash sphinx. I already have one in the collection, but that one was already dead and all break, broken down. Well, yeah, it's a pretty cool find. Very random. Alright, so I put him in this little container here, and I think this little guy, or this big guy, is pupating because his suction cups don't really work, and it was just on the side, and it looked a bit like this, and this one looks like it's pupating as well. It's the same species. So, yeah. And it's pretty large, so it's probably fifth in star. I mean, I've never seen anything like it, so I wouldn't really know. Well, yeah. Even though it's got those little parasites there, I just want to zoom in. It's kind of out of focus. Little white dots, like, there. It's got little parasites, it looks like. It's pulsating, kind of like uh, the rosy maple moss. And the suction cups don't work. I realized the same thing with rosy maple moss. So anyway... Here I've got these pictures, and I'm trying to find, trying to find out if this is what it really is. I'm just looking on Google Images. Hmm. This is the adult moth right there. This is what it looks like. So it's a pretty cool looking moth, but. It's pretty large. I think it's 15 star. This one is brown. Wait, wait a minute. I think I saw something. This one is brown. It's really weird. Oh, there you go. That's a pupa. It's a fresh pupa there. Um, then I'm trying to figure out if that's what it looks like when it's pupating. It's kind of brown. But, because this one is really light colored. But yeah, that's pretty much it, and I'll see you next time. Goodbye.